After nearly a decade since its initial announcement, the Tesla Semi has finally been officially launched, and production of 10,000 full FSD units has begun. To date, 874 Tesla Semi purchase orders have been approved, distributed across 72 different entities, including both individual and corporate customers. The good news is that these new semis are being almost entirely redesigned compared to the 250 prototypes previously in use. The updates go beyond aerodynamics, with nearly every component being refreshed, from the headlights, windows, and mirrors to the chassis. They are also expected to be released at a significantly lower price than previously announced. As Elon Musk emphasized during Tesla's 2025 annual shareholders meeting, the FSD version of the Tesla Semi is slated for mass production early next year. Um, and then starting next year, we, we manufacture the Tesla Semi. So, what does the 2026 Tesla Semi full FSD look like, and how much cheaper is it really? Welcome to the Tesla car world. Tesla has officially confirmed the first commercial customer for its highly anticipated semi-electric truck and perhaps unsurprisingly, it's Tesla itself. During the 2025 annual shareholder meeting, the company revealed that it will deploy the semi within its own logistics operations starting in 2026 before offering the trucks to external partners and commercial clients. This strategic move positions Tesla to fine-tune the truck's performance and operational reliability in real-world conditions, setting the stage for a broader rollout. While Tesla has conducted pilot programs with partners like PepsiCo and Frito-Lay, the company is prioritizing its internal fleet once mass production begins. Dan Priestley, head of the SEMI program, explained that Tesla intends to be the first company to fully integrate the SEMI into its own logistics operations, gradually replacing gas-powered trucks with electric alternatives to create a more sustainable supply chain. Priestley acknowledged that although the SEMI has already been tested with external partners, the company has not yet fully shifted away from traditional fuel-powered transport. The 2026 internal deployment marks a strategic milestone a deliberate step toward electrifying Tesla's own logistics and setting a blueprint for future commercial operations. Tesla's dedicated semi-production facility in Reno, Nevada, has reached a key milestone in construction, bringing the company closer to full-scale manufacturing. Alongside infrastructure progress, Tesla unveiled several design enhancements aimed at boosting efficiency and payload capacity. These upgrades are expected to make the semi more competitive for long-haul applications and better suited to heavy-duty logistics, addressing some of the key challenges facing commercial fleets. The refreshed semi, highlighted during the shareholder meeting, showcases how Tesla is rethinking both form and function. In fact, only a handful of semis, roughly 250 units, have ever rolled out of Tesla's factories since the truck's initial reveal in 2017. Until now, every vehicle on the road has essentially been a prototype a testbed for the ambitious vision Elon Musk promised nearly a decade ago. But at the 2025 Tesla annual shareholder meeting, Tesla lifted the curtain on a refreshed semi that's poised to take the heavy-duty trucking world by storm. And make no mistake, this isn't just a cosmetic update. It's a glimpse into the future of autonomous, high-efficiency freight hauling. The new semi is instantly recognizable yet undeniably evolved. Tesla has reimagined the front end, borrowing design cues from the Cybertruck and the Model Y, giving the truck a sleek, modern look while emphasizing function alongside form. The previous vertically stacked headlights have been replaced by a bold, full-width light bar, stretching across the entire cabin, giving the Semi a futuristic face that's both commanding and aerodynamic. The bumper has been reworked, now featuring carefully sculpted aero channels that guide airflow more efficiently around the front wheels. Even subtle details like new cameras mounted ahead of the doors to supplement traditional side mirrors hint at Tesla's push toward a more autonomous future. The truck isn't just a vehicle, it's a high-tech statement on wheels, blending aggressive styling with thoughtful engineering. And Tesla didn't stop at looks. Beneath the refreshed exterior lies a series of meaningful upgrades aimed at performance, efficiency, and usability. The Semi's drag coefficient, already impressively low for a Class 8 truck, has been further reduced. This seemingly small adjustment, just a fraction of a decimal, translates to a substantial increase in efficiency, potentially extending range by tens of miles per charge. Tesla claims the Semi now achieves 1.53 kilowatt hour per mile while maintaining a 500 mile range, meaning each truck packs roughly an 850 kilowatt hour battery. That's an enormous power source, 
yet thanks to Tesla's aerodynamic improvements and lightweight battery design, the Semi remains efficient, capable of hauling massive loads without compromising performance. Speaking of hauling, Tesla has also increased the payload capacity. The Semi is now better equipped to carry heavier cargo per trip, a critical metric for fleets looking to maximize operational efficiency. At the same time, the truck's curb weight has been reduced. Likely, thanks to the use of Tesla's next-generation 4680 battery cells, which offer high energy density while trimming unnecessary mass. The combination of aerodynamic efficiency and advanced battery tech doesn't just improve range. It also reduces overall energy consumption, making the Semi a compelling alternative to traditional diesel trucks, which burn far more fuel and generate far more emissions. Performance-wise, the Semi remains a beast. Tesla claims 1,072 horsepower under the hood, delivering instant torque that's characteristic of electric powertrains. Acceleration from zero to highway speeds remains surprisingly quick for an 80,000-pound Class 8 truck, thanks to a design that slices through the air with minimal drag. And when it comes to charging, the Semi maintains an impressive maximum input of 1.2 megawatts, allowing the truck to regain 70% of its range in just 30 minutes under optimal conditions. For fleet operators, this is a game changer. Drivers spend less time waiting and more time on the road, dramatically improving efficiency and lowering operating costs. But perhaps the most tantalizing aspect of the refreshed Semi is its readiness for autonomy. Tesla claims the truck is now designed for autonomy, signaling that the next generation Semi is more than just an electric vehicle. It's the foundation for a future where trucks may operate safely with minimal human intervention. Although details are sparse, the inclusion of additional cameras and sensors, combined with Tesla's full self-driving hardware platform, suggests the Semi is being prepared for eventual over-the-air software updates, potentially unlocking autonomous highway driving in the near future. For a trucking industry grappling with severe driver shortages, this is a transformative promise. Less stress, reduced fatigue, and safer long-haul operations. The Semi's new design also focuses on the driver experience. The cockpit has been thoughtfully refined. Narrower but more curved windshields improve aerodynamics while still providing excellent visibility. The cabin layout, featuring Tesla-style dual touchscreen displays and a central driving position, makes handling a massive 80,000-pound truck feel surprisingly intuitive. Gone are the days of cramped, noisy diesel cabins. The Semi is a truck designed to attract a new generation of drivers, offering comfort, control, and even a sense of pride in the vehicle itself. All of these updates come with a strong nod to cost efficiency and manufacturability. Tesla has leveraged more shared components from its car lineup, simplifying assembly and reducing production costs without compromising quality. While the exact price of the Semi Gen 2 remains unannounced, industry analysts speculate it will fall between $160,000 and $190,000 depending on configuration. Considering the massive savings in energy and maintenance costs compared to diesel trucks, up to $200,000 or more over the vehicle's lifespan, the Semi promises to deliver not only a high-tech experience, but also significant financial advantages for fleet operators. So, how to order a Tesla Semi 2026? In the past, Tesla closed public Semi reservations in August 2022, focusing on fulfilling early commitments and pilot programs. Major logistics players, including Walmart, Cisco, Anheuser-Busch, UPS, DHL, and JB Hunt, have already locked in orders that will convert to production allocations in 2026. Companies outside this early pool must engage directly with Tesla's commercial vehicle division to secure trucks, as standard consumer ordering channels are no longer available. When the reservation system was active, Tesla employed a tiered deposit structure to secure production priority. An initial $5,000 credit card deposit, followed by a $15,000 wire transfer within 10 days, with additional $20,000 transfers, required for each additional truck. These deposits were refundable until a formal purchase agreement was signed, after which payments became non-refundable. Once production orders commence, Tesla will issue a purchase agreement specifying vehicle configuration, pricing, delivery timeline, and applicable fees, with reservation payments applied toward the total cost. Production for the 2026 Semi will begin internally as Tesla deploys the first units within its own logistics network to validate performance and efficiency under real-world conditions. External customer deliveries are expected in the second half of 2026, with priority given to early reservation holders. 
fleet operators can anticipate delivery confirmations by mid-year, followed by handovers in the third quarter and the fourth quarter. Pricing for the 2026 semi remains unannounced, but industry estimates suggest a substantial increase from the 2017 base of $150,000 to $180,000. Analysts recommend budgeting $250,000 to $300,000 per vehicle. Though lower operating costs, reduced maintenance, and improved driver efficiency make the investment financially compelling over five to seven years. The redesigned semi impresses with technical capabilities. Energy consumption is approximately 1.7 kilowatt hour per mile, offering over 500 miles of range. Ultra-fast charging at 1.2 megawatts allows 350 highway miles in roughly 30 minutes via Tesla's proprietary network. Payload capacity has increased, maximizing cargo efficiency per trip. Crucially, the semi is engineered for eventual full self-driving integration, signaling a transformative leap in driver assistance and operational automation. For fleet managers, the key to securing a semi in 2026 is early engagement. Companies should work directly with Tesla's commercial division, prepare detailed fleet usage analyses, and coordinate with Tesla's infrastructure team on megacharger installation to ensure operational readiness. Tesla is entering a pivotal phase in bringing its revolutionary all-electric semi-truck to market. The company's dedicated semi-manufacturing facility in Reno, Nevada, has reached near-completion status, with the factory now transitioning from construction to equipment installation and initial production preparation. This represents a watershed moment for Tesla's ambitions to transform the heavy-duty trucking industry. The Tesla semi-production facility, spanning approximately 1.7 million square feet adjacent to Gigafactory, Nevada, has achieved major construction milestones that position the company to begin manufacturing operations on schedule. As of late October 2025, external construction work has been completed, with the facility's building structure fully enclosed and weatherproofed. The focus has shifted toward internal installation of production equipment with drone surveillance, confirming that heavy machinery, including massive stamping equipment, has begun arriving at the facility. The factory parking lots are now populated with company vehicles, signaling preparations for production staff deployment, and this dedicated facility represents Tesla's commitment to high-volume semi-production, with a designed annual capacity of 50,000 trucks per year once fully ramped. This manufacturing capacity dwarfs the previous pilot production approach, enabling Tesla to address what Elon Musk has characterized as ridiculous demand for the electrified truck. Tesla has confirmed that initial production will begin in late 2025, with the company building limited quantities for validation purposes. Vice President of Vehicle Engineering Lars Moravi stated during Tesla's recent earnings call that, we'll have larger builds toward the end of this year, and then our first online builds in the first part of next year, ramping into the second quarter timing with real volume coming in the back half of the year. This timeline means that meaningful volume production will commence in the second half of 2026, marking the transition from pilot programs to commercial availability for the broader logistics industry. Tesla will serve as the first customer, incorporating semis into its own supply chain operations starting in 2026. However, companies including Walmart, Cisco, Anheuser-Busch, UPS, DHL, and J.B. Hunt has already placed orders and is positioned for early deliveries. At its 20th, 25th annual shareholder meeting in November, Tesla unveiled a comprehensively updated semi-design that incorporates significant improvements based on learnings from pilot fleet operations. The refreshed model features a sleeker chassis, designed with Model Y-style blade-like headlights and a refined front bumper that improves aerodynamics. The wrapped windshield has been scaled down for improved driver visibility, and the roofline has been redesigned with more rounded contours. The updated semi now features an impressive energy consumption rate of 1.53 kilowatt hour per kilometer, approximately 1.7 kilowatt hour per mile, making it substantially more efficient than the previously announced specifications. Range capability exceeds 800 kilometers, ensuring that long haul operations remain viable without frequent charging interruptions. Payload capacity has been increased, allowing operators to transport more goods per trip and improving economic returns on vehicle investment. The Semi is equipped with an 800 kilowatt drivetrain and supports 1.2 megawatt ultra-fast charging capability, utilizing Tesla's proprietary supercharging infrastructure. 
This represents a fundamental competitive advantage, as charging times can be minimized during regular operational breaks, thereby maximizing fleet utilization. It's clear that Tesla is aiming to significantly reduce production costs for the second-generation semi. The updates to the truck's front-end design do more than just improve aerodynamics. They also simplify manufacturing and maintenance processes by incorporating components shared across Tesla's lineup, such as the Cybertruck and Model X. This approach gives Tesla a scale advantage, a critical factor in lowering the final production cost while maintaining healthy profit margins. Although Tesla has not officially announced pricing yet, industry analysts speculate that the Semi Gen 2 could fall between $160,000 and $190,000, depending on the chosen configuration and range. Regardless of the final number, this next-generation version is expected to be far more refined and capable than the current prototype. This anticipated price reflects not only the enhancements in battery technology and aerodynamics, but also Tesla's broader ambition to make electric heavy-duty trucks a mainstream, commercially viable solution, rather than a limited niche product. As Dan Priestley hinted, the Semi Gen 2 is designed to be not only more affordable, but also more efficient, both in terms of production and operational performance. Elon Musk has also indicated that customers will have the option to configure the Semi according to their specific driving needs. This means a buyer could potentially choose a version with a shorter range for a lower cost, tailoring the truck to their operational requirements. Even without a low initial purchase price, the Tesla Semi promises substantial savings over its operational lifetime due to dramatically lower running costs compared to diesel trucks. Operating cost is always the defining factor in a truck's long-term value, and this is where the Semi truly stands out. While the upfront price may seem high, the total cost of ownership over several years is compelling. Energy costs, which typically constitute the largest portion of trucking expenses, provide a striking example. A conventional diesel truck averages about one gallon of fuel every 6.5 miles, with U.S. diesel prices hovering around $3.50 per gallon. That equates to roughly $0.46 cents per mile. In contrast, the Tesla Semi consumes only 1.7 kilowatt hours per mile, at an average commercial electricity rate in California of approximately $0.18 cents per kilowatt hour. This translates to just $0.30 cents per mile, nearly 45% cheaper than diesel. For a truck covering 100,000 miles annually, Electricity costs would total around $30,000, compared to $54,000 for an equivalent diesel truck. That $24,000 annual savings is significant, and over a 10-year period, it could amount to approximately $240,000, almost the cost of the truck itself. Maintenance savings further reinforce the Semi's economic advantage. Traditional diesel trucks contain thousands of moving parts, internal combustion engines, transmissions, clutches, exhaust systems, turbochargers, all of which require regular service or replacement after hundreds of thousands of kilometers. So what is the one feature you would like to see added to the semi-gen cabin design? Please share your opinion in the comments section below this video. Thanks for watching our video. Subscribe now so you don't miss the next breaking Tesla update. It's coming in just two days. If you want to explore more exciting information about Tesla EV or Tesla Bot, don't forget to hit the like button and share this video. Also, make sure to turn on notifications so you never miss our latest videos. We appreciate your support and look forward to seeing you in the next video. Goodbye.